Hi folks, welcome back to Edible Whole Foods. Are you a friend of Whole Foods on Facebook or Edible Piedmont? You should be. And the reason you should be is because then you will know about all the in-store events, the in-store tastings that are great ways for you to try wines and foods and get to know butchers and, and your fishmonger and your baker and, and the people that are in the store. And they want you to try food. And the recipe that we're gonna to do today was came from exactly that, a wine event, Italian wines, at North Raleigh a couple weeks ago. And Brian, who is their assistant team leader in the, in the fish seafood department, was doing this scallop dish, and I was just blown away by this scallop dish. Thank you. Tell me how you came about. Uh, originally, it was uh, in the North Raleigh store with a big scallop sale. Uh, they also had some Bing cherries on sale at that time. Uh -huh. so pitted some Bing cherries, reduced it in some balsamic, and put it over the baby arugula with a little touch of uh, blue cheese. It went over really well. And then a couple weeks ago at the store, we had, a, like you said, an Italian wine tasting. Yeah. Uh, so I paired it up with the scallops again, and I used a black cherry preserves this time. Uh, seeing that I didn't have any cherries in season. Uh, also used an Italian uh, gorgonzola picante and paired it up with a Portofino uh, white wine. Why are Whole Foods scallops better than maybe other scallops around? Um, all the scallops that Whole Foods brings in are all dry packed. They don't have any added phosphates and water content in them. So you're not paying for the preservatives, you're not paying for the water. And when you actually cook them off, if they were wet packed, you're actually steaming off all the water, you're losing size. And you never get that caramelization on them. No sir, not at all. These are sea scallops. Yes, sir. Those are U10s. Which, tell people what U10 stands for. That would just stand for under 10 and a pound. Uh huh. Uh, almost like a shrimp count where you would have a 21 to 25 count. Average and how many you're going to get in a pound. Now, could you do this recipe with bay scallops? Definitely. I wouldn't see why not. This is nothing more than balsamic vinegar that you reduced a little bit. Yep. Right? And. Just some regular preserves. Yes, sir. Okay, now can I show you a neat trick? Sure, love to see one. Okay, if you don't want to reduce this, y'all got this lovely little product that's, that's reduced already. And for the sauce, I cheated, and I used this and the preserves to come up with that. So you're gonna have to tell me if my little shortcut worked. I'm sure it'll save time. But that way it kind of makes it, it, you know, this, this would be a very elegant, weeknight dinner. Oh yes. As definitely. well as something great for for company. Did we do okay? I love it. This is that seven seconds where he can't say anything. I could I could talk to him about anything and he couldn't reply. It wouldn't change a thing. The actual reduction came out nice out of the Yeah and it's just, just a quick little shortcut. Yeah definitely. You happen to know somebody around this store like that knows something about wine too, don't you? Yes we actually have our um Hi, Fred. Wine buyer, this is Leela. Hey, Hi, Leela, honey. how you doing? Hi. They uh, just so happen to be uh, the wife. <laughs> yeah. You forgot the wine, the Orvieto, to go with it. Mm, thank you. That's what we had paired with it, which was Wonderful. fabulous. Mm -hmm. it goes really well Absolutely with it. Absolutely fabulous. So, go like them on Facebook. Get to these events. They have local night events. They have lots of different ways for you to taste product. So, come in the store. And you've got great people like Brian who know how to cook seafood, who want to help you. They've got great recipes. Come see us. Come see us again on Edible Whole Foods.